If you've ever looked up into the night sky and wondered if life lay between the stars, then you may be familiar with our guest today, Whitley Strieber. Whitley, the material from your book um, actually comes from your own experiences with aliens. The Grays is a novel based on my own experiences with these strange beings which have come to be called popularly the Grays because they're small, they have big black eyes, and they're sort of gray in color. Partly it's based on my knowledge of the, the context of this experience that many people have had. Could you tell us a little bit about the story? Well, the story of the Greys is, is the story of an attempt on the part of these beings to build a relationship with a community. Uh, it starts with a family and goes back generations as they create by drawing people together, certain people that they have chosen together for their genetic patterns and genetic makeup to, over the years, create a certain child with a certain, certain types of ability, a certain level of intelligence. And they intend to use this child as the means by which they will communicate with the world. Because the great problem they have is that they are so different from us that they have no direct way of communicating. Government officials who are involved in this and very afraid of it react. They react very negatively to the presence of this child and they try to gain control over the situation and there is a conflict between the Greys and the government over the child. You have some graphic and horrific descriptions of medical anomalies and otherworldly experiments. There's the, uh, something involving the removal of sexual material from the human body that I experienced myself, uh, that other people also experience in this phenomenon. And it's not too surprising. I mean, if, they, if we are dealing with aliens from another world, they would be very interested in the DNA structure of the species on the planet. And one of the things they would be doing would be sampling sexual material, of course. We'd be doing it just like it's being done to us right now. Tell us, who in your book, or what, are the three thieves. When uh, an abduction is about to happen, one of the things people see beforehand are these triangular sh three stars coming, moving slowly through the sky. And then the next thing they know, these beings will be around them. In the book, they, they have a sort of slightly sinister, slightly kind of jokey quality. And that's exactly how, they, how it felt to be around them. Well, there's been a heightened interest and the possibility that perhaps our government has been covering up or withholding information about these encounters. Do you believe that that is the case? Obviously, something strange is going on, and uh, the face that the government puts on it is that it's all nonsense, and that can't be true. Whitley Strieber's book, The Grays, is a mind-bending tale that will alter the way you think about distant space and about the mysterious creatures that may not be so distant anymore. The book, on one level, it's a work of fiction. On another level, it's a textbook. It's a primer. And it'll teach you, from if you read it from beginning to end, just how to communicate with them in this way very productively. Um.